So we've been here for 24 hours at the Office of Indian and Northern Affairs Canada. Um, we've just been informed that a few of our demands may be met at some point today. Um, and while we have a few people leaving out, we still have really strong numbers outside, including even a small uh, school children, a big group of them, outside just in the front lines with a few of our demonstrators um, outside of this building. Uh, we've also been made aware that Prime Minister Trudeau may be, may be able to um, go to Attawapiska in the next few hours and that we may be made aware of that in the next few hours as well. Um, so this has been a 24 hours of a huge amount of victories for us. We've also been now able to bring our food in and our coffees and that feels really, really great and uh, it's with a lot of the support that we've been getting on our live feeds and a lot of the um, publicity that's been getting that we've been able to get this attention from the police and I feel like they, um, and as well as building management, are pretty... Uh, pretty starting to listen to our demands and our concerns and the demands and the concerns of the youth in Attawapiska. Um, we, uh, we have now set up a female bathroom and we've been given access to have that in a separate closet space in the back there, which is a huge victory because we are not only coming from First Nations peoples here, we are from a multitude of backgrounds and our allies here are, are also really struggling along with us. Um, obviously that struggle is nothing li like uh, those living in Attawapiska or other James Bay and Northern Manitoba regions. Um, or those living in any remote communities. However, we are still uh, we still want to struggle along for that fight. I've been given direction from the building that if you guys want food, that will help facilitate bringing it up for you. Okay. okay so if you've got, uh, contrary to the information I had received earlier, they've uh, they've changed their position on that. So if you guys have food that is being delivered here or need. Okay, so one of my officers will come, will, will go down with, uh, with one of you folks to bring it up. So you'll be allowed back uh, for the purposes of bringing the food. Again, the in and out privileges are the same, but the, the food will be, will be brought up. Okay. So you had orders to not let food up here and that has been rescinded now? No, we're, we're bringing food up. No, you did have orders at one point to not let food up here? We're not going to get into that. I'm going to tell you what the status is right now. My understanding is there is uh, something that is in the works that may uh, be in relation to that, that will be some sort of publicly announced. I don't know whether it's going to be Skyped or whether it's you know I'm not a I'm not a techie guy but it may have some of the your concerns may be acknowledged and some of the answers you may have may be publicly announced.